Mm-hmm. Yo, so something that you, you spoke about, you were saying that's like something went viral and you kind of like kept going in that direction. Mm-hmm. Is that a tactic that people should do more often? Like, because I. Nope. I'm going to tell you why. Unless it's in your field. Because I'll give you an example. There's somebody who is a lifestyle blogger, right? And they want to do vlogs. They do in travel, all type of shit where they just want their, that's what they want their channel to be about. So. Let's say that you know that it's really popular to make a video about how much you get paid on YouTube. So you're like, okay, I'm going to film this video because for sure that video is going to do numbers. They always do. Everybody that make a video about how much they get paid on YouTube, it always does numbers. And you say, okay, I'm going to do this video. You do that video. It blows up just like you thought it was going to. Mm -hmm. Now, everybody that followed you from that video is following you because of this type of content. Mm -hmm. So either you have to keep making this type of content that you never make telling people what to do on YouTube or you're going to go back to doing your lifestyle vlog and you're going to have all these new followers and you're going to have no engagement because they have no, they don't want to watch that video. That's not what they came here for. They came here for, because you were telling me how much I can make on YouTube. So I expect all your videos to be like that. So how can we, because this now I'm learning, right? So how can I attract that following for something different? Is that possible? Because for example, like my YouTube, Mm -hmm. I have, 30,000 subscribers. Mm-hmm. But all of my subscribers came for like, so I was doing freestyles at one point. Like, I had rappers come then on. Then you need to freestyles. make a different video. I mean, you need to make a different channel. Oh, shit. A whole different channel? Uh, I mean, I don't know if it's too late for that now. I don't think so because. You should make a whole different channel because all your subscribers came for your freestyles. They're not coming here for your podcast. Mm. You need to make a podcast channel. And you can see the difference, though. Like, yeah. you'll see, like, podcasts. I'm talking about some bullshit. Yeah. Like, but, like, you'll see a rap video. Yeah. I'm like, the fuck, bro? Yeah. Yep. Damn. But that's what your subscribers came there for originally. I mean, I had the same thing, though, because when I first started, I was doing makeup mm-hmm. and just tutorials. And then when I started switching over to lifestyle, it was really hard. However, lifestyle is closely related with, with makeup. So I was mm. able to, like... Get some of the followers. Yeah, get they they cared a little bit because even in my lifestyle vlogs, I'm doing my makeup sometimes. So I was able to get my people to transition. But if it's something that literally one does not have to do with the other, you probably need to start. It's crazy channel. because I was telling somebody that like it might sound crazy, but not to you because you clearly know this. I was like, yo, what I hate. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's a gift and a curse. I don't like going viral. Oh it yeah, fucks up my Instagram. Like yeah. I got a lot of followers because I went viral like four maybe five times. But it's all the way was different. Yeah. First time was for something. Second time was for something. Third time was something totally. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And it's like, it frustrates me because like now it fucks up my engagement. Like I might post it something. It does. I'll post something. It does fuck up your engagement. Bro, like I'll post something and like. Yo. Instagram is hard though. But I don't YouTube even is harder. I don't think so. I think, I think YouTube is easier than Instagram. And I have more followers on Instagram than YouTube. I hate. I hate Instagram's algorithm. It literally makes no sense. Bro, YouTube I have I, every time I go on to you on to Instagram every single day, Instagram tells me I have like two hundred more followers every mm. single day. My number on YouTube has stayed the same for like over a year. I don't understand because every time I get on, it's, it's like you have two hundred new followers every single day, every single day. But my number on YouTube has uh, not on YouTube on Instagram has stayed the same. Instagram is like the hardest thing to figure out. That's why I said I don't even like taking sponsorships on Instagram. My Instagram, like I actually don't. I literally gave up on the algorithm. I don't care anymore. I rather literally just post pictures when I'm doing stuff, just to post. I like you know what I like on Instagram now. I like that they took the uh, like button off and, and that you can hide your likes. I'm gonna tell you why. Oh because yeah. Now, like me, I can post a picture, and let's say if I'm not getting a thousand likes, even if I'm getting five hundred likes or whatever, if I hide it, I can now I can post something that I really like because yeah. you're not gonna know anyway. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. I got pictures on there that got a thousand likes, and I still hit it. You know what I'm saying? Because the next po- the next picture might not get a thousand, might get four hundred, but I like the picture. Yeah. And, and certain people like their feet to look a certain way. Yeah. So like I like that they took that off. Yeah. I personally think YouTube is harder just because it's like it's more. What is it called? It's is um not encouraging. It's, it's discour- discouraging. 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 <laughs> How about I say disencouraging? Discouraging. <laughs> it's, it's discouraging. I'm gonna tell you why. Because like for me, like like you said, you get a video on YouTube that did really well, mm-hmm. that did fifty fifty thousand. Now you post a video and it easy to a hundred, not a hundred thousand, a hundred. And it's like, yeah, I'm not like this is embarrassing. 
So it's, it's like, not embarrassing though. To you. Cause you ain't getting a hundred views. <laughs> I did though. I did. And I, I actually I it's so funny, I actually recently deleted that video because there was a video I did that did not do well at all. Like right, so it you literally deleted did terrible. It's dis- discouraging. Well, See? I deleted it. I del- it was discouraging, but I actually deleted it because I felt like it wasn't on par with the rest of my content. 